Hi. What if aliens invade us from outer space? What if Christ makes a second coming? What if all the volcanoes of the world erupt at the same time? What if, what if, what if? What if global warming turns out to be a catastrophe? Well, maybe we should prepare for all of those possibilities. Maybe we should just spend trillions of dollars every time somebody dreams up a gloom and doom scenario. But here's a better approach. Why not look at the empirical evidence? The empirical evidence doesn't support the what-if uh, theory of global warming, and the empirical evidence does support the idea that there will be an economic catastrophe if we, if we chase every what-if scenario. Let's try looking at some evidence for a change. Look at the chart before you. You'll see that it consists of carbon dioxide data for the last 600 million years or so, and it also consists of global temperature data for the last 600 million years. And what you'll see is a complete lack of correlation between the two. And what that proves is that carbon dioxide, at the very worst, has a very small impact on global temperatures. In fact, it's not even worth writing home to mom about, uh, let alone something you should panic over or get overly concerned about. And so that's the basic hole in your argument, is that you don't look at the evidence. You just simply draw a little box on the chalkboard and, and fill in some squares. Big deal.